In today's video, we can't turn right. I'm talking about these three signs. If they are pointing to the right and we go past, we fail the challenge. These two areas do not count. Can we avoid making any right turns for the whole match? Let's find out. Now this is an interesting challenge. We can't turn right. I don't know how this is going to go. That's a slow start, but the item space could be good for us. A custom dice would be really helpful. The ability to choose how many spaces we can move is going to be a big help on this challenge. But hopefully we can get it. If I can get the timing right, okay? Yes! Good start. Now, I got a few ideas about how to survive this challenge, but all it takes is one computer player to land on an event space, and it's pretty much all over, so it's going to be very interesting. Wario loves causing mischief, so I'm definitely going to be keeping my eye on him. Let's see what he gets at the item shop. Is that a double dice, I think? It is, okay. Anything that doesn't affect us is fine. And he's going to land on the lucky space as well. He could get his coins back here, or he could get another item. Oh, 15 coins, that's pretty huge. And our boy Luigi, going last, only rolls a 2. Pretty slow start for him as well. Okay, the first minigame of the day is going to be Hot Rope Jump, a free-for-all minigame. I do like starting with free-for-all minigames, because it means you can get a little bit ahead in the coins, provided you win. Doesn't always work out that way. But I'm fairly confident we can win this one. We can make it to at least 50. Right about here is when they start to drop off. Rosalina a little bit out of time there. Oh, Luigi's the first to go. I think Rosalina's going to be next. She's jumping a little bit too late. How did she survive? Wario is third. Rosalina second, and we take first. Okay, we're going to put that custom dice to use right now. We're going to roll a 10. That's going to put us past the sign, which is facing left at the moment, which is exactly what we need. Should we buy another item? We probably should. I don't know... I could get another custom dice, but then I can't afford the star. The star's pretty close. The warp block would be a good emergency item. So maybe I'll go for the warp block. Okay, that leaves us with 13 coins. We do unfortunately land on the red space. It was the only space we could land on, but uh, that's fine. Rosalina rolls a three, pretty low roll. She's kind of stuck at the start there. Oh, Wario's gonna use his double dice. He only needs 11 to get the star. That is bad. Oh, that's so lucky. Okay, hopefully we can get the star next turn. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Gets the event space. He could get the dice fruit. He does. Please. No! Go down. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. He actually bit us to the star. That is upsetting. Uh, have you ever seen a better star placement? It's literally right in front of us. That is amazing. All is forgiven, Wario. Although now he's heading towards Boo, so that could be another problem. Alright, Luigi rolls another low roll, only three, and he's going around again. Him and Rosalina are up to something. Maybe they're just collecting items, I don't know. Okay guys, we have to win this minigame, if we want the star. We have ten coins, we are right next to Toadette. We need to win this to get to twenty coins, so we can buy the star next turn, or I'll be very upset. Wario is, uh, he's given us a little bit of competition. Okay, hit the mine, that's good. Now we've got Rosalina giving us a hard time. I'm mashing as hard as I can. Okay, Rosalina gets hit. That's good. Wario's completely out. We got it. Incoming star. There it is. Star number one for Team T-Law. Wow, the next star is right next to Luigi and Rosalina. Maybe they knew. Maybe that's why they were going around in circles. Okay, unfortunately, we're going to have to land on Bowser. Getting some tough rolls today. First the red space, now Bowser. Please don't take my star, Bowser. I'm so proud of that star. Be nice to me. At least we don't have any coins to lose. Oh yes, lose one star isn't even there. And we get 20 coins, which we don't even have. We have zero coins. So we'll be seeing you later, Bowser. Okay, Rosalina seven coins short for the star. Custom dice is a smart play. I don't know why she's rolling nine. She probably wanted to roll a little bit lower than that. Did she just go back on the red space? Okay, no. She went on the item space. That's fine. Wasn't such a bad roll after all. What are the odds of Wario getting 50 coins before he gets to Boo? Oh, he could go backwards here, which would be bad. Unless he went really far back. Okay, loses coins, that's good. Luigi's so close. Oh, he rolls a 1, that is really perfect for him. He just needs to get 5 coins before the next turn. Which, I don't know, might actually be hard, we'll see. Okay, we're playing Flash Forward, another free-for-all minigame. 
and I always famously get robbed on this minigame. I could take the best photo in the world, and I still won't win. Look at that pose, that was perfect. That's gotta be a tie between me and Luigi, surely. Maybe even just me. Four points? Four points! Are you serious? What do you want from me? That's a perfect photo! Oh man, I'm a little bit salty about that, but I have to say, at least I got a great photo of the green team. Me and Luigi, it was a nice photo. And now Luigi can afford his star, so, you know, I'm happy for him too. At least I lost to Luigi and not one of the other two. I think I might go for the reverse dice fruit here. I'm just worried that I'm going to go too far back. But if I get like a mid roll, oh no, that's really bad. Because now the sign's going to change and we're going to be right in front of it. So we might have to use that warp block. And we get the Bowser space again. No. Two turns in a row. Please, please can we get lucky again? I still don't really have any coins, so just don't take my star. Okay, we're, we're good. Give 10 coins, that's fine. You can take my three coins. I'll get them back. I'm not even worried. Fingers crossed for the Bowser bonus star, right? Two Bowser spaces in four turns. That's, uh, that's pretty spicy. Rosalina gonna spend almost all her coins on a custom dice. That's an interesting play. Now would be a great time for Wario to pass Boo. But I don't think he's quite gonna make it. No, he's gonna land on the red space. He's gonna be, I think, two spaces short. So surely next turn, he'll get Boo. Here goes Luigi. Oh, beautiful roll. And he's gonna make it to the star. I'm so proud. That's my boy. Okay, Toadette in a pretty tricky location for us. It's gonna take us a while to get to there. In fact, probably easier to just try and get a golden pipe. That's a more likely scenario. Luigi gonna pick up a double dice. He's got a lot of items. A lot of dice blocks. And he's gonna land on the lucky space, so he should probably hope he doesn't get another item. But he gets a double dice that he just paid five coins for. So that was kind of a waste. Okay, we're playing Hand Car Havoc. And no, I'm still not very good at this minigame. But I think I'm getting better. I feel a record coming on. We've been getting close lately. I'm starting to get the balance between braking and accelerating and turning. I should really practice this minigame outside a match so that I can really get the hang of it. But we normally win, just we don't, we're not like really good, but a win's a win, so it's fine. Oh, are we gonna get the record? Oh, we do, just. So guys, let me explain the situation right here. We are three spaces away, or four spaces, away from the sign which is facing right which is bad so if we warp we have a chance of swapping with rosalina or luigi who are right next to this sign which is also facing right which would be very hard to avoid so basically we have a one in three chance of warping with wario which would be safe or we have about a one in five chance of rolling low enough so that we don't make it to the sign which is pretty bad odds so we're gonna just have to try the warp block, hope that we warp with Wario. Pretty much the only way the video is gonna continue. Please. Oh my gosh! So lucky. So, so lucky. That's insane. I was getting ready to say my goodbyes. And we steal the boo. That is awesome. I mean, no one really has any coins, but I guess... Sorry, Wario. It's a tough turn for Wario. Switch places with him and then get him with boo. Although he isn't first, so I mean, I don't know why I'm being so sportsmanly. Wow, so we're safe for a few turns now. We don't have a sign for a while. That was so lucky though. I mean, that was a huge play. We're gonna finish up on a lucky space. A very fitting. We've been a very lucky turn and we get another seven coins. Rosalina not using her custom dice and she rolls a one. So she's landed on the event space, which means she's gonna switch that sign. That's gonna be out of sync with the other two signs. So we've gotta keep a record of that. Man, this challenge is tough. There's a lot to think about, but it's very fun. I'm enjoying it a lot. Luigi should really consider using some of those items. He's, uh, he's hoarding them a little bit. Lands on the event space. He could get coins or he could get another dice. Gets another dice. He probably needed the coins more to be honest, but Whatever, he lands on the lucky space. He could get the coins here, maybe. Okay, that was lucky. He definitely didn't need another item. Okay, we're playing a later skater, another free-for-all minigame. I think we've only had free-for-all minigames today. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't remember any team or one versus three minigames. We're off to a pretty good start. We're zooming, actually. Last time we played this, I kept hitting into the wall on the inside. 
And then a little later on, I realized I was doing the controls wrong. So this time, I know exactly what I'm doing. That was a very quick race. No record though. All right, five turns down already. Do not check how long is left on the video. That's cheating. We want it to be a surprise. It could be one turn left or there could be five. Hopefully five, because I'm having fun with this. It's quite a unique little challenge. So at the moment we're in first, but not by much. Rosalina, the only one without a star. So she gets picked and she gets a double dice. Okay, I'm hoping the item shop has restocked because normally they have golden pipes. Please, that would be awesome. Yes, we can get another star. Maybe even two if we're really lucky. But that is a huge help. And it also kind of works like a warp block. So if we're in a bad spot, we can just use the golden pipe and move out of the way. Looks like we're going to have a versus match as well. That's fine. No one really has a lot of coins, but I'm feeling good. I think we can win this. Well, I have to win this because I need coins for the star. So just don't give me Bowser's big blast. Okay, trapeze artist. Interesting. Definitely a losable minigame. I would love a few Goombas over here. Please? Come on, give me more than three. What was that? That was the worst thing ever. Don't even talk to me. I don't think that was even possible to win. I don't think there was any point where I had more than three Goombas. We got absolutely robbed. So upset. Oh, how convenient. Rosalina, 12 spaces away from the star. And she gets exactly 12 and she just won 25 coins from a rigged minigame. Yeah, that's right. I said it. That minigame was rigged. I was never going to win. There was no chance of that. Toadette moves down to the bottom again. Pretty far away from everyone, actually. Oh, and Rosalina gets a chance time. I like this. Or do I? Is this good or bad? I don't know. Actually, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Chance time is never good for me. At least Birdo's not here. Okay, we're out. It's fine. Oh, the old switcheroo. So Luigi's going to lose one coin. That's uh, it's pretty good circumstances, to be honest. Okay, Wario rolls a two. Pretty low roll, but that's all right. Oh, is he going to use his key here? He is. Do not see many people go through that gate. Or at least I don't. He gets an item space, so he could get something good here. And he gets another skeleton key. Okay. Luigi's still not using those dice blocks. He's just holding on to all those blocks. I don't know what his plan is. And he keeps landing on lucky spaces and getting more items that he can't use. Uh, it's not a great strategy. He keeps getting coins, actually. Where are all my team minigames at today? I haven't had anything other than free-for-all minigames. Rosalina just took my coin bag. Not happy about that. He's bullying me. She just pushed me into that hammer. That was all her fault, not my fault whatsoever. She took another coin bag. Can you go on the other side, please? This is actually my side. Why is she... She seems like so much stronger than me. She pushes me so far away. And she got another coin bag. This is a disaster. Absolute disaster. Okay, we're just going to hold on to the golden pipe for now. That is a great roll. Beautiful roll. Actually, to be honest, we probably want low rolls because I don't want to get background to the sign. The sign is scary. I don't want the video to end. Rosalina's probably going to buy a golden pipe. Oh, she doesn't make it to the item shop, but next turn, surely she will. Hopefully she doesn't get coins here. Okay, that's good. I don't mind that. Wario coming up to Boo again. Hopefully he doesn't get 50 coins. Oh, finally! Yeah. Using an item. And he's gonna go with the double dice. He gets a four. That is... He got punished for that. Hey yo! Finally, a three vs one minigame. Tube it or lose it. If anyone's gonna lose it, it's gonna be Luigi. Am I right? You know what I mean? Do you get it? Because, yeah. The L on Luigi's hat actually stands for loot. A little fun fact for you guys. Okay, this is getting a little bit scary. Kind of all up to us, as usual. I mean, shouldn't be surprised. Oh man, this is close. Go, 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 go! Yes! What a win! Only a few turns left, but we're getting close to that sign again. So I might have to buy a custom dice. Because I don't want to take any chances. We're actually lucky we didn't roll a 9 or a 10, or the video would have been over, so that would have sucked. But luckily we rolled a 6, we land on the lucky space, we've got a custom dice and a golden pipe, so things are looking good. Rosalina gonna use her custom dice, don't know what her plan is, but okay, she's gonna roll a 1 and land on the red space, very confusing. Oh, maybe she was worried that Wario was gonna steal her coins. 
I mean, she's stolen first, so he's still gonna steal her coins, but... Maybe that was her thought process? That's actually why I bought a custom dice, guys, because I don't want to be in first place. That was the real reason. I have big brain in it. Either way, that worked out pretty well. It's not often that we don't get targeted by Boo, so that was pretty nice. It was nice to be a spectator for once. And Wario gets a double dice. Oh, Luigi's got a taste for it now. He's using all his items. Gonna use his custom dice and rolls a three. Going on the event space, I'm guessing. Yeah, is he going for coins or is he going for another dice roll? I feel like dice would have been good, but he gets the coins. Green team, baby! This is what I've been waiting for all day. I've been calling out for team minigames, and this is what I wanted. Me and Luigi up against Wario and Rosalina. It's not even fair. You know we're going to win. There's no point even playing the minigame because it's a guaranteed win. But unfortunately, we are contractually obligated, so we have to play it out. Those are the Mario Party rules. Oh, can we get one more? Can we get one more? Oh, yes. 12 beautiful cakes. Okay, we're going to use our custom dice to get past this sign. Because remember, this sign is facing a different direction to the other signs. So we can't use our golden pipe. Otherwise, we're going to be right next to a sign that's facing right, which would be very bad. And I thought, hey, why not just land on Luigi's space while we're at it and have a little jewel, steal a few more coins. Okay, thankfully we got a mini game that we can win pretty easily. That could have actually backfired really badly. Because if we lose this jewel, we can say goodbye to our star next turn. This is actually really weird. There's only two obstacles on the whole track. Normally you'd get like 10. So it's really all about hitting the boost and dodging the two obstacles. Looks like we're a little bit better at hitting the boost than Luigi though. Got a pretty good lead. Last obstacle. We hit it, that doesn't matter, we already won. Oh, I forgot about the event space. I think, uh, I think it's safest to go for coins. Because if we get another roll, we could make it to the sign if we got a high roll. So I'm not going to risk it. And everyone loves coins, right? Alright, looks like Rosalina is going to use her double dice. She only has 21 coins, so she can't buy a golden pie, which I'm pretty happy about. She just got 10 coins. This game is so rigged towards Rosalina today. Okay, she bought the golden pipe, but surely she won't get enough coins next turn, right? Please? Oh, okay, that's good. She's gonna lose five coins there, so she's down to one coin. I mean, all she really needs is a lucky space, right? And I think she's, yeah, she's gonna land on the lucky space. Please, please don't give her 20 coins. That would just be so unfair. Okay, I'm really surprised. That is good. All right, now Wario is probably gonna do exactly the same thing as Rosalina. He's using his double dice. He rolls 17, great roll. He's probably going to buy a golden pipe as well. Yep, looks like he is. And he actually has 20 coins, so that's a little bit more of a problem. Oh, actually, no, I forgot about the bank. He's going to lose 5 coins here. All he needs to do is land on a blue space, which is pretty likely. Oh, that's such a bad play. Such a bad play. Why did he do that? He really wanted the item. That was greedy. All right, now we got Luigi. He rolls a 5. Much shorter turn than Wario and Rosalina. Not a lot going on for Luigi, but that's alright. We like that because he is a big threat. Alright, we're playing Storm Chasers. Gotta water our little piranha plants. Our cute little piranha plants. And then they grow up and then they try and eat you. Actually, why are we doing this? Piranha plants are nothing but trouble. You only need to play one Mario game to know that piranha plants are bad news. We should be exterminating these things, not watering them, helping them grow. I suppose they are pretty cute though. If we keep it in the pot, it'll be alright. Wait, what if it's one of the ones that shoots fire? Oh god. Alright, it's the final turn, you know what that means. It's golden pipe time. And we don't have to worry about the sign, so we've pretty much survived this challenge. Which I'm very happy about, and it's gone pretty well. I'm impressed with how well we've done. I think we can give ourselves a little pat on the back. Here we go past our last sign. No right turns for the whole match. Rosalina not going to be able to use her golden pipe. That was a pretty bold purchase. Although she definitely could have pulled it off. If she got coins instead of the custom dice, she would have had a good chance. Wario though made the worst play landing on that item space. He could have got a star this turn. He was just so desperate to use that skeleton key though. But it's good for us because now he's only going to have one star. 
Nobody using their items this turn, which is weird because they all had dice blocks, so they could have used them, but they didn't, so whatever. And the final minigame is going to be Shy Guy Says Classic. I love this minigame, but I also hate this minigame. It's a lot of fun, but it's also quite stressful. Shy Guy is a pretty ruthless captain. He's unforgiving. To be honest, I think the power's got to his head. And another thing, the minigame is called Shy Guy Says. He doesn't say one word in this whole game. So that's a lie. He should be the one drifting out to sea. Should be called Shy Guy Shows. I mean, he does make little noises, but that doesn't count. Quah is not a word. But then again, that's how all the characters talk. Oh god, I'm reading way too into this. I'm in too deep. Alright, we made it. The final announcements. Time for the bonus stars. We have a one star lead. Everyone else is on one star. We're on two. Mini game bonus. I mean, you know. You know who it's gonna be. It's your boy, Yoshi. Obviously, that puts us on three stars, which means we cannot be beaten. But let's have a look at the next bonus star. It's the unlucky bonus. I'm not sure who that is, actually. Rosalina. Well done. But unfortunately, that's not going to be good enough. There it is. Another win for Team T-Law, baby.